and in today's episode. Getting caught up by the tide. Need to get over. Oh, another big wave. One step closer to the edge. Wanna do some cliff jumping here? And the most beautiful dive you can do in New Zealand. What's up everybody? My name is Mark. I'm a small town guy from Germany who decided to quit his business management job and sell all his unnecessary stuff to travel around the world. After a couple of weeks of vacation in Bali, my adventure was about to begin. I took a flight to New Zealand, bought a car and lived now full-time in a 2000 Toyota Astana. But this is just the beginning of my journey, so make sure you subscribe to not miss out on all the upcoming adventures. Good morning, it is moving day. I spent four days in Wangarei now, so today I thought it's time to go up further north to a place called Tutu... I think it's, <laughs> the thing it's called Tutu Kaka. <laughs> Kaka. Yeah, before we start going up there, Time for a morning routine. That's pretty much it. So, time to actually to do kaka. Tutukaka. I'm right now at the lighthouse track. At Wangarei I got myself also a walking track um, flyer for Tutukaka. But it was actually by accident. I just thought it looked good so I picked it up. I'm gonna do the Tutukaka coastal walk today. It's just a one hour walk to the lighthouse and back. Since it's only an hour I'm only gonna bring my water and probably my drone again so maybe I could get some nice footage again. Go. So in my mind I had like an, you know, those old school lighthouses, the tall ones with the white and red stripes and stuff. That's what I expected. Uh, yeah, pretty disappointing. <laughs> let, me, let me show you what the lighthouse looks like in 2023. This is a spectacular lighthouse. Thumbs up. At least to get a good view from up here. Anybody want to do some cliff jumping here? Not me. Okay, done with my quick little break. Now it's time to get back down again. So the tide definitely got higher, I feel. Whoa. Yep. Now I need to... Ah. 
Need to get over. Ah, oh, another big wave. Okay, gotta gotta be quick. Here it leaves. Ah, fuck! Completely wet foot now. Damn it! Stupid idea. Need to take off my shoes. Should be easier now. Ah, oh. oh, yeah, that works. Good thing I didn't spend any more time up there because. Okay, at some point you can't get back. I know. Already pretty high. But I made it. Okay, back at the car. It's time to head to the next campground. But I want to try something new. Instead of me showing you my B-roll driving and stuff, let's go for some editing magic. One, two, three. Easy. Lovely. Right at the beach. Can stand here for one night, max. So, it's a good place. Probably just gonna hang out here for the day. Okay, I got super bored at the beach and that's always a bad thing because every time I get bored, I look things up. Found out that there is like uh, scuba diving here with the Pornite Islands, world's best spot to do a scuba dive. Since I did my advanced open water dive in Bali, I would love to do one. It's a bit expensive, around about 200 euros, 200 US dollars, but for two dives at one day. Um, yeah, I'm just on my way to the dive shop to check it out. All right, quick and easy. Um, 360 New Zealand dollars in total, which would come around 200 euros. But it's probably one of the best dive sites in the world. In the world, so I don't want to miss it out. Like spending money can can come back, but the experience I will keep forever. Huh? Some wise words today. <laughs> Good morning. It is. A quarter past seven, so I gotta be at the dive shop in an hour, which means enough time for a quick little breakfast and a coffee. So on the website they say what kind of stuff you need to pack. So they say just go for for a normal beach day, pack the stuff you need for a normal beach day, and you're good. And they take care of the rest. I get my action cam, towel for sure, my drone. Also, some extra battery on your power bank. That's it, ready to go. Good morning. Good, and you? Still need to pay, right? The awful part now. <laughs> okay, so it'll be three hundred and sixty-four dollars. Yes, looks hard for sure. Yep. <laughs> You'd be surprised how much cash we get allowed. Oh really? Points. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll need a physical card. Oh, that's what I thought. <laughs> So 16 people today, not that many. Nice quiet day. Do you guys sell by any chance like those waterproof bags? Um, if you can't see anything, uh, it's dry in the bottom, you'll be fine. Uh, okay, yeah, no, just because this one ripped off, you know. Oh, so yeah, I don't just, think just the now. surf shop will, but they're not open until when you get back. But you can get one of these. Oh, okay, okay, thank you. <laughs> hey, how are you? Good, didn't you? Great, what's your name? Oh, Mark. Yes. Cool. Nice to meet you. Where are you from? Nice to meet you. Uh, Germany. Ah, nice. What are you filming for? Um, just trying to vlog, you know, I just started because I'm doing a road trip and then I'm heading to Australia. I came from oh, Bali, that's so I'm so cool. going a whole back trip. like YouTube before? Ah, uh, yeah. Because, uh, let's get started. Yeah, make sure to like and subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's do some gear. Um, what's my shoe Um, I think your co oh, already he's... managed yeah, he's 45. 45. Okay. 
perfect. Did you say it was good? Yeah, it's good. Oh, cool. cool. So these are your fins. Sweet. So, um, yeah, just pull to tighten. Yeah. And then to take them off, hold here and then lose it. Have you done much diving? Um, I just did my advance of water oh, and yeah. dive like in Bali like oh, yeah, yeah. six, seven weeks ago. Oh, nice. Sweet. Where, where did you dive in Bali? Uh, Gili Tea. Oh, nice. Cool. Wait, so we have this one first, and then the second, right. and the zip goes at the back. So it's slightly different to Bali, but keeps it nice and warm. That's a men's large. So it should be cool. Fabulous. That's it? That is it. So the master and tanks and weights are on the boat, and all you have to do is go to the boat. <laughs> So it's across the road, down the ramp, and it's the second blue and yellow boat. Blue and yellow boat? Yeah, just the second. All right. This is three. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> the second blue and yellow boat, she said. show the footage of the deep dive just wanted to let you know I'm not a colorist I've never done color grading in my life before I just started using DaVinci Resolve a couple of weeks ago I tried my best to make it look as natural as possible but also keep in mind we went down up to 30 meters which means there is almost no red light coming through so I spent the whole day <laughs> color grading like this short amount of clips just like footage shot on a super cheap action cam for 90 bucks which i bought four years ago just to let you know
first I've done. It was good. Couple of stingrays, lots of fish, clearest water I've seen in a while to be honest. And now it's lunchtime and then we're heading to the second spot. Okay. Which is hopefully gonna be great as well. And I'm hoping to see some sharks, maybe. Um, they've seen some mantas once in a while here, but yeah, we'll see. done. Second one was also oh, stunning. The water is so clear here. Our group didn't see any sharks but the other group did see quite a few of them. Uh, such a bummer but still sea life, untouched marine bay, uh, pretty awesome. <laughs> Coming up next, a private beach ah, just for myself. Nice. No one's here. Taking a step back in time. It really looks like in the 1900s. And enjoying the little things in life. But guess what? They have a shower. First shower in six days, I guess. 